But the man who is staying in that nine spot, Jeff McNeil, and we are joined with him now out at Chase Field in Phoenix, Arizona. Jeff, first of all, congratulations. A big extension for you coming off of a huge season. But you were very open how much you wanted to be on Team USA. We've heard it from your teammates like Pete Alonzo as well. So what was that like for you to track them down and say, no, I, I want to be in this lineup? Uh, yeah, I think when uh, I found out Pete was going to play, um, you know, I let him know that, you know, I wanted to be a part of this, uh, you know, Team USA team. So I think, uh, you know, he reached out to, to Tony and, uh, you know, my agents reached out as well. And, um, you know, it took a little bit. Um, but, you know, I was lucky enough to, uh, you know, be on this team and, uh, you know, playing some second base for them. Hey, Jeff, when you, when you think about this moment, you know, how, how, you know, how, how much does it mean to you, uh, you know, getting a chance to be around these dudes? Uh, you know, I know a spring training mindset, but just, just talk about just being around these guys and how much fun you have having. Uh, yeah, no, it's, it's been a blast so far. Uh, you know, get to play with the uh, you know, best players in the world get to, you know, be on the same team as, you know, Mike Trout, Mookie Betts, and, uh, you know, it doesn't get any better than that. So uh, it's been a lot of fun so far. Uh, you know, we had a good first game, and I'm um, looking forward to, you know, going to battle against Mexico tonight. And you're speaking of Mexico, you're three for three when facing Sandoval. I know you're going to count this as a, a totally new day and new numbers, but what's it been like for the guys? Because some of you are batting in positions in the lineup that you haven't had to be in before. Uh, yeah, no, I think it just shows how deep this lineup is. Um, you know, I'm bat ninth. You know, something I'm not uh, you know, too used <laughs> to doing. You know, I've done it. I've done. I've done, I've, done, I've done it before. But yeah, no, we got a bunch of guys. You know, uh, you know, batting at the bottom of the lineup, and uh, they're at the you know top half. You know, one, two, or three in, the, in their uh, lineup back home. So uh, it's a little bit different. Uh, I think guys are you know embracing embracing their role, and they'll hit anywhere. And uh, you know, I think we're all you know happy to be a part of this team. You know, I'm jealous because you're getting a chance to be around King Griffey Jr. You know what I mean? 22 yeah. years in the big leagues, Hall of Famer. Uh, are, are you a sponge to what he's talking about? Uh, yeah, no, it's been fun. Uh, you know, Griff's been, been great. You know, he's been talking to me, uh, you know, on the bench in the cage and, uh, you know, telling me, um, you know, give me some, some hitting tips. So, uh, you know, hopefully, you know, can apply them and, uh, you know, have a big, uh, big tournament here. We've been so much discussion this year about all these new rules in Major League Baseball, but of course the WBC doesn't play with them. Have you guys discussed the fact that you just saw the clock, you don't have it, and now you might only have a week when you get back to regular camp to readjust? Uh, yeah, no, the clock's been interesting. Um, you know, yesterday's game, I think this game would have been tough to play with the clock. You know, just <laughs> you kind of got to you kind of you kind of got to you kind of got to slow yourself down when you're up there. You're on a stage like this. Uh, you know, they're big moments, so, uh, you know, you kind of need that extra breath in the box, uh, you know, a little bit, you know, extra time to, uh, you know, get gathered. But, um, you know, I'm sure we're all going to be uh, you know, just fine when we get back to camp and, um, you know, we'll adjust. You talk about mindset, you know how we are. We, we sort of creatures of habit. You know, how, how have you been able to slow the heart rate down, get yourself in the right frame of mind and, and go out there and, like you said, have meaningful for bats uh, and, and, and sort of be in the moment? Uh, yeah, no, I just focus on my breath. Uh, you know, every time I get, before I get in the box, you know, I'm taking a deep breath, uh, you know, trying to, you know, live in the moment, try to slow everything down and, uh, you know, try to focus on that pitch. So uh, I think I've done a pretty good job in that uh, aspect of my career. And, uh, you know, it need just, just need to apply it to, uh, you know, a tournament like this. Well, Jeff, I certainly think uh, the baseball community agrees. You've done pretty okay <laughs> with it in your career. We'll be wishing you the best of luck tonight with Team USA. All right, thank you so much. Appreciate you, man. Have a good one.